Earlier, I told you about the relaunch of David and Annie after the 90 days. However, despite their love for each other, the guys encounter difficulties and surprises. For example, Annie may be pregnant, the couple is back in Thailand, and this trip includes David's daughter Ashley. They again hope that Annie's brother Jordan and her cousin Amber can come to America to attend school. David is also becoming a monk, and I assume it's just for a photo shoot. Because after his hair transplant surgery, he is worried about having to cut his hair to do it. David hopes his hair will grow back, but his worry is not unreasonable. Annie and David then go on a trip with Amber and Jordan. Part of the goal is to enroll them in an English class. This step can help them make a good impression and provide every possible advantage the next time they try to bring them to the United States. Of course, another part of their goal on this trip is to introduce these two to some reflections of American culture in Thai. Many countries around the world are familiar with America, but Annie's remote village is very far from the metropolises of Thailand. There is conflict too. Jordan doesn't want to go to America because it means saying goodbye to his girlfriend, and frankly, it's age-appropriate. Not surprisingly, he gets into an argument with Annie about it, and although Annie claims that she wants it to be his own choice, he accuses her of forcing him to come to his thought. The main twist, however, is when Annie admits to the doctor that it has been three months since her last menstrual period. I didn't think I would ever think about being a father again, David admits to the camera. And it's not surprising, and it's understandable. I've seen Annie undergo an ultrasound, but I'm still waiting for the results. Let's wait together, shall we? Subscribe not to miss anything, guys. Thanks for watching.